The Subaru Technica International Division was created in the late 1980s to coordinate development of Subaru's rally cars. They now also create high-performance consumer versions of the Impreza WRX, which combine power with precision and performance with practicality. Power is generated from a 2.5-liter 16-valve boxer engine with turbo and intercooler. Generating over 300 bhp at 6,000 rpm, trademark poise and pin-sharp handling are retained at all times. The five-door hatchback design has been developed from the standard Impreza model. Noticeably widened body flares and a longer wheelbase with shorter front and rear overhangs clearly define the Impreza WRX STI and outline its performance credentials. The RX-8 was launched in 2003 and has sold over 160,000 units worldwide. So far, this car has won more than 50 global awards, including many Car of the Year awards in 2003 and 2004. With a refreshed look and an improved performance, the latest RX-8 is still as stylish and fresh as it was when first launched. The Mazda RX-8's most unique feature has to be its Renesis Rotary Engine Genesis engine, which generates an incredible 232 bhp from a comparatively small, naturally aspirated 1.3 liters. Redlining at 9,000 rpm and with a very smooth power delivery, this light engine succeeds in creating an exciting driving experience. The five-spoke wheel design features a shape which can be traced to the triangular rotor shape of its engine. Rear hinge doors show innovation in allowing passengers to easily access the rear seats while retaining an overall sports car size and shape. The super high output of the EcoBoost twin turbocharged engine is what defines this sleeper sedan from Ford. Anyone who overlooks the style of this revolutionary, high quality American sedan will be blown away by its hidden performance. Creating more power than larger, naturally aspirated engines, the 3.5 liter V6 is twin turbocharged and able to generate peak power of 365 bhp while providing a maximum of 350 pounds per foot of torque across a broad range from 1,500 to 5,250 RPM. The purpose-built police interceptor will replace the iconic Crown Victoria as Ford's police car of choice from 2011 onward. The new police interceptor is fully equipped inside and out to support all the needs of a modern law enforcer. Power, passion, performance. The Z story continues. New tech yet old school. A new shorter, sharper design, batched ahead of the front doors with the famous glowing Z signature that double as side indicators. The front engine rear wheel drive layout is the way a sports car should be. The engine with variable valve event and lift, VVEL, thumps out 332 bhp and 270 pounds per foot of torque, propelling the car to 60 miles per hour in just over five seconds. The genes of the Z are running through every new curve, edge, and sculpted corner. The window is reminiscent of the original 1971 240Z. It's still low, it's still aggressive, and now it's got boomerang taillights. The Dodge Charger name is a historical one associated with performance. With four-door flexibility, the Dodge Charger SRT8 is a sophisticated, versatile muscle car that excites at every turn. The 425 bhp that the 6.1-liter Hemi V8 generates makes it equally as powerful as the legendary Hemi engines of the muscle car era. The Dodge Charger also features an electronic stability control designed to assist drivers during extreme steering maneuvers. Prominent wheel arches house the familiar five-spoke aluminum and wheels, while the aggressive front grille, broad-shouldered fenders, and sloping fastback roofline allow the Dodge Charger to dominate the road in style. Different for a reason. Known as Evo to its friends, 
This is the high-performance sedan and the 10th official version to date. The Lancer Evolution saw success in the World Rally Championships with driver's titles from 1996 to 1999 and a Constructors' Championship win in 1998. One of the Lancer Evolution's most revolutionary technologies is the Super All-Wheel Control SAWC system, which indirectly directs engine torque to the outside or inside wheels as needed. Making use of all available traction, SAWC gives the Lancer Evolution unparalleled paralleled cornering, acceleration, and safety. Every element of Lancer Evolution is specifically designed to improve performance and safety, from the racing developed aerodynamics to the wide fenders, aluminum roof, and vented aluminum hood. First produced by the Ford Motor Company in the 1950s and affectionately known as the Crown Vic, this car has become the iconic police and taxi car. Its body-on-frame construction makes it very rugged and easy to repair after minor accidents. The only full-frame rear-wheel drive passenger car built in North America. A 4.6-liter V8 drives its rear wheels, resulting in handling which lends itself well to police driving techniques, where the front of the police car is used to push the rear of the fleeing car. The police version of the Crown Victoria has a black front grille and rear fascia on the trunk lid. Black trim can also be found under the taillights. The next generation police interceptor from Ford will be based on the Ford's latest unit body full-size chassis with a seamless transition already underway. Distinctive, resolute, strong-willed. Accept no compromises, make conscious decisions, and be governed by nothing other than one's own free will. This is the only way Porsche know how to build a car. Six horizontally opposed cylinders define the Cayman S's naturally aspirated flat six and enable its mass to be positioned lower in the car. Although the engine is naturally aspirated, a two-stage resonance effect creates oscillations in the intake manifold, which generates a turbocharging effect and optimizes induction. To further reduce lift and to add to the overall performance and sporty feel, the front has been restyled with enlarged air intakes. There is a constant interaction of convex and concave curves that create a style like no other. Vorsprung Deutsch Technik, lead through technology. Three words that express the very essence of Audi. The TTRS features an aluminum Audi space frame, which is rigid, strong, and incredibly light. As well as improving safety and agility, it also helps fuel consumption. The Audi TTRS has a turbocharged 2.5 liter TFSI engine that produces 340 horsepower and 450 newton meters of torque, making it the most powerful TT ever produced. A high-performance chassis and quattro all-wheel drive complete this exhilarating sports car. The TTRS has been given a smooth, flowing design. As a result, its drag coefficient, a measure of aerodynamic resistance, remains surprisingly low. Coupe or Cabriolet? Why not have both? The target design offers a panoramic glass roof which forms an integral part of the car's body. While the connection to the sky has been made more transparent, the connection to the ground has been solidified with an all-wheel drive transmission. The amount of fuel injected directly into the engine is carefully controlled electromagnetically. This controls the efficiency, power, and also improves the internal cooling of the engine. The 3.8-liter power plant can now generate 385 bhp at 6,500 rpm. Based on the 911 Carrera, including its very low drag coefficient, the Targa 4S has larger air intakes to increase cooling power and give an even more dynamic appearance. Its imposing LED taillights are drawn right into the wing, making them unmistakable, especially at night. Built like an athlete, the Gran Turismo S Automatic maintains the purity of the original's lines while providing power, driving pleasure, and still has space for four adults. 
When revving above 3,000 RPM on the move, the exhaust valves open to allow the exhaust gases to escape more quickly, creating a lower back pressure and a peak power of 440 bhp. The effect of the self-adapting gearbox is a smooth ride at low revs and consistent power delivery at high revs. New side spoilers add to the dynamic look, and new 20-inch wheel rims that mirror the design of the famous Trident logo render Pininfarina's work of art even more intriguing. The grill has concave vertical slats that give the appearance of inhaling air even when stationary. All legend, no compromise. A modern interpretation of classic Mustang heritage. With flowing lines that emanate from highly sculpted surfaces, four designers achieved a seemingly impossible feat to give even more muscle to this iconic car. Below the domed hood lays a beast growling, waiting to be unleashed. Building on learnings from creating the 40th anniversary Shelby GT500KR, the refined supercharged 5.4 liter V8 now develops more power, more torque, and is more fuel efficient. Refinements to the body shape and the ceiling components was the key to guiding the airflow around the car and creating more downforce with less drag. The front of the car features an improved splitter and a flush hood, which sets it apart from the base Mustang. Reigning king of the asphalt jungle. Boasting DNA from its legendary predecessor, the Dodge Challenger SRT8, manufactured at Chrysler's assembly plant in Ontario, has unmistakable looks with ground-shaking performance. Featuring a 6.1-liter Hemi V8, the highest specific output naturally aspirated engine ever offered in a Challenger and low drag aluminum Brembo calipers, the Challenger SRT8 can accelerate to 100 miles per hour, then stop again in less than 17 seconds. Dual round headlamps, performance hood, and signature full width tail lamp contribute to a classic profile inspired by the 1970s legend. Consider history rewritten. Even the line between concept and reality was beautifully drawn. After a seven-year wait, the new Chevrolet Camaro is back and honors the style and performance of the original 60s Camaro. The SS is the performance version of the Camaro, which includes a 6.2-liter V8, an independent front and rear suspension that is a first for Chevrolet Camaro. The complete package gives the driver confidence due to its stability when cornering. Featuring classic Camaro proportions including a long wheelbase, V-shaped nose, and a 2.5-inch power dome in the aluminum hood. The twin raised roof takes cues from Corvette to give the new Camaro a distinctive Chevrolet appearance. Sporting tradition, Italian passion, and engineering prowess. The values that have made Alfa Romeo a legend find perfect expression in the Alfa Romeo 8C Competizione. The legend takes to the road in a limited edition of only 500. Powered by a 4.7 liter V8, situated just behind the front wheels, and capable of developing 450 bhp at 7,000 rpm, the engine is not only responsive, but helps create a perfect 50-50 weight distribution that ensures stability as well. Developed by the Alfa Romeo Style Center and with thousands of hours in the wind tunnel, its original line has been styled around its wheels with a powerful muscular side. The most exciting combination of luxury sedan and performance sports car that Maserati has ever produced. During the six years of its life, the Quattroporte has received no less than 56 awards. Using the same 4.7 liter V8 found in both the Gran Cabrio and the Gran Turismo, it can generate 85% of its power from as low as 2,500 RPM. The MC AutoShift software allows controlled starts that can accelerate its 1,990 kilograms to 60 miles per hour in a little over five seconds. Although this car features an extra set of doors, the most noticeable styling difference over the other Maseratis is at the front. A wider grille is used, the fog lamps and air intakes have been integrated, and the front light cluster has been redesigned with a titanium finish.
Built for racetracks, master of the road. For 20 years, the 3 Series has been entirely devoted to the world of motorsport. The fourth generation BMW M3 Coupe is all about adding the finishing touches to perfection. A light, high-revving, naturally aspirated V8 sits at the front of the M3. With a peak power of 420 bhp at 8,000 rpm and an 8,400 rpm redline, the M-Power engine performs best when it's spinning fast. A distinctive carbon fiber reinforced plastic roof helps reduce weight and significantly lower the center of gravity, while bonnet vents, rear spoiler, and diffuser effectively minimize uplift. Motorsports is the DNA of the BMW M3 Coupe. Carbon Motors has designed the E7 the world's first and only purpose-built law enforcement patrol vehicle. Designed by law enforcement, exclusively for law enforcement. The Carbon E7 is designed to provide the highest level of officer protection using world-class technologies and processes, meeting or exceeding all regulatory requirements, including a durability of 250,000 miles. Each car will be built to order. The body structure is built around an aluminum space frame, which has a rear impact crash capability of 75 miles per hour. Prominent features include automatic license plate recognition, weapons of mass destruction detection, infrared night vision capability, and 360 degree highly conspicuous lighting. Rear hinge doors make loading suspects into the back seat compartment easier and safer. Even standing still, the XK looks fast. Its sweeping athletic lines and muscular rear haunches exude immense visual energy. Fast has never looked this seductive. Visual energy is created by an aluminum skin stretched taut over the light, yet strong and immensely rigid body structure. This energy comes from the XKR's purity of design, with sculpted surface created to cut the air with aerodynamic efficiency, delivering the visual promise of breathtaking performance and driving excitement. This strong and lightweight advanced aluminum body architecture is the key to maximizing the car's performance, dynamic agility, competitive CO2 emissions, and fuel economy. Jaguar's racing heart beats fastest in this supercharged XKR. Powered by Jaguar's 5-liter supercharged V8 engine, it is the finest expression of XK power and performance. Seductively powerful and exquisitely finished, the Aston Martin DBS is the ultimate blend of refined performance and minimalist luxury. Representing a milestone of Aston Martin's technological abilities and car design, it is an open invitation to drive, the supreme temptation. Truly great luxury sports cars are rare. In a world often diminished by mediocrity, genuine design innovation and engineering accomplishment are available only to the discerning few. With its race car roots and luxury appointments, the Aston Martin DBS is just such a car. One of the most potent production Aston Martin's ever made, the DBS represents the synthesis of raw power, race bear technology, and design excellence. Powered by a hand-built V12 engine producing 380 kilowatts, it delivers breathtaking power and performance. Like a well-toned athlete in a figure-hugging suit, the aluminum and carbon fiber bodywork of the DBS is a tight wrapping on the muscle that lies beneath, expressed in the taut lines and heavily sculpted flanks. Using technology developed in competition, the DBS is a direct descendant of the DBR9, a thoroughbred race car that has won many of the world's greatest GT endurance race titles, most notably back-to-back GT1-class honors at the coveted Le Mans 24 Hours in 2007 and 2008. Carbon ceramic brakes and adaptive suspension that adjust to virtually every situation ensure that the DBS is perfectly at home in the city, on the open road, or on the track. The original Gallardo is the most successful Lamborghini of all time, with 7,100 being sold. The new Gallardo LP564 has a more powerful engine and is 20 kilograms lighter, resulting in an increased performance without an increase in emissions. Traction has also been increased over its predecessor, thanks to improvements to the four-wheel drive transmission, suspension, and aerodynamics. A smooth underbody and rear diffuser helps to suck the car onto the road at higher speeds. 
The new Lamborghini Gallardo LP564 is a master at taking corners fast. An optimized weight distribution of 57% to the rear was achieved by placing the engine lengthways, hence the LP, longitudinal posteriore in the model description. Four doors, four seats, eight cylinders. Up to this point, others may even have been able to keep up, but this Panamera joins the long line of Porsche turbo models with boosted power, as well as including an extensive suite of equipment as standard. The Panamera Turbo uses the seven-speed PDK Porsche Doppelkupplung, which is essentially two gearboxes in one and thus requires two clutches. With two separate input shafts, one inside the other, the flow of power is only ever transmitted through one half of the gearbox, with the other pre-selecting the next gear for quick and smooth gear changes. Porsche believed that form should follow function. Nothing else would make sense. The front, shoulders and rear all have instantly recognizable Porsche traits. Particularly striking are the side air outlets behind the front wheels, paying homage to the Carrera GT. The first Corvette was designed by Hurley Earl in 1953 and was named after a small maneuverable warship. The Z06, first introduced in 2005, is from the sixth generation and is the performance model featuring an improved larger engine and an aluminum frame. Featuring lightweight titanium intake valves and connecting rods in its 7.0-liter aluminum block V8 and technologies gleaned from the Corvette Racing Factory program, class winner in six out of the last ten years at the prestigious 24 Hours of Le Mans, the Z06 is the lightest Corvette of them all. The sixth-generation Corvettes are the first to have exposed headlamps since 1962. Six hundred horses don't slither. The Dodge Viper has always been the big gun of American muscle when it comes to engine size and raw power. With SRT in its name, the Dodge Viper SRT10 also guarantees balanced performance and benchmark braking. Street and Racing Technology, SRT, worked with McLaren Performance Technologies and Ricardo Corporation to develop an 8.4-liter V10 with more efficient breathing and a higher engine speed. To handle the increased torque, a smaller diameter twin disc clutch and the latest evolution 6-speed Tremec T56 manual transmission were also required. A noticeably larger and more efficient hood scoop and venting can be seen on this iteration of the Viper, which helps to cool the new larger engine. This car has all the classic Viper detailing with its crosshair grille, deep cut sides and swept back fenders. It's hard to say what sets Pulse is racing the most, the performance or the looks. The new Mercedes-Benz SLS AMG features a distinctively pure design, superior dynamics, and levels of safety and everyday practicality that are the hallmarks of Mercedes-Benz. The conversion to dry sump lubrication allows a significantly lower engine mounting position, with the resulting lower center of gravity enabling high lateral acceleration and scintillating vehicle dynamics. Power is distributed from the AMG 6.3-liter V8 to the rear axle via particularly light carbon drive shaft, similar to those used in DTM C-Class touring race cars. With its unique gull-wing doors, the SLS AMG is a classic of tomorrow, which takes cues from the legends of Mercedes-Benz. A long wheelbase and bonnet combined with a wide track and large wheels creates proportions that are unmistakably supersports. The Super Snake is a package offered by Shelby to enhance the power and looks of the Ford Shelby GT500. Everything a balls-to-the-wall muscle car needs. With an increase of 16 horsepower of boost on the Whipple Supercharger, the peak power of the 5.4-liter V8 has been increased from 550 bhp at 6,500 rpm to 750 bhp at 6,200 rpm. If the driver is able to harness all this extra power, they will complete the standing quarter mile in 12 seconds flat, with a speed of 120 miles per hour at the line. The hood is now one giant air scoop designed to push as much air into the supercharger as possible. A prominent carbon fiber splitter can also be seen, which will certainly help push the front tires into the road when trying to corner while accelerating.
After 40 years as Lamborghini's test driver, Valentino Balboni has been honored with a car that bears his name. Hired in 1967 by the company's founder, Ferruccio Lamborghini, he has helped develop the character of many classic cars, including the Miura. It was evident early on that Balboni had a special feel for the cars he worked on, with him saying in 1973, a Lamborghini must always combine the precision of a race car with the reliability of a good friend. The 250 LP552s that will be built are made even more desirable by being the only Lamborghinis currently in production that are rear-wheel drive. A white and gold stripe runs the entire length of the car and is inspired by classic sports cars of the 1970s. These distinctive colors are found inside the car as well, with the center console being upholstered in striking polar white leather. Only available from seven specific Nissan dealers throughout Japan, the Spec V is aimed squarely at the enthusiast driver who is prepared to pay for race car-like performance on the road. Exceptional supercar rivaling performance is achieved from a twin turbocharged 3.8 liter V6 and race spec suspension, brakes and wheels. A novel boost control system provides extra torque that should help the driver to exit corners in a higher gear. Carbon fiber rear spoiler, front grille, brake ducts, and a unique ultimate black opal body color are exclusive to this model. 20-inch alloys and a titanium exhaust complete the no-compromise approach to ultimate performance. Aston Martin's most exhilarating sports car yet, the V12 Vantage, is the ultimate performance interpretation of the Vantage range combining an inherent agility with formidable power. The most potent production sports car in the Mark's 95-year history, the Aston Martin V12 Vantage is the fastest and most agile model in the range, designed to provide a unique character that appeals to different drivers with different tastes. Based on the hugely successful V8 Vantage, the V12 Vantage features Aston Martin's most powerful engine, the 6.0-liter V12 engine. Purposeful, striking, and functional styling signals the performance capabilities of this formidable car, which, like the Aston Martin DBS, benefits from the use of race-derived technology and features lightweight carbon fiber. This is the homologation model which qualifies the car to be raced in a range of racing series. The creation of the RS Rennsporter Racing Sport allows drivers to experience the thrill of a finely tuned race car on the road. The 911 GT3 was a great starting point. The goal was more power, higher performance and faster lap times. Engine power is now 444 bhp at 7900 rpm, while the braking system has been overhauled with new composite brake discs. Lap times are now definitely faster. The body is 44 millimeters wider at the rear and for the first time 26 millimeters wider at the front, which means wider tires can be used and improved cornering is achieved. A fixed rear wing straight from the racetrack and contrasting colors of the wheels, wing mirrors, logo and side plates add to the overall look. Although development officially began in 2006, the SL65 AMG Black Series is the culmination of more than 40 years of dedication to performance. One man, one engine. Each AMG 6-liter V12 bi-turbo engine is hand-built by a single engineer before it's lowered into the body. To optimize the power-to-weight ratio, the engine power has been increased to 661 bhp, and the car's weight has been reduced by 250 kilograms. Except for the doors and attached wing mirrors, all bodywork parts have been replaced for the AMG Black Series. A wider stance and an extending carbon fiber rear spoiler, a first for a Mercedes AMG car, improve the poise and grip and create a menacingly aggressive appearance. The R8 5.2 FSI Quattro is a winner. Its genes contain the cumulative experience of eight Le Mans triumphs and many other victories achieved by Audi over the past nine years. A zero to 62 mile per hour sprint of 3.9 seconds and a top speed of 196 miles per hour exemplify the breathtaking dynamics of the R8 5.2 FSI Quattro. 
the V-10, which is to a large extent a new development, exploits a total displacement of 5,204 cc and is designed to rev up easily, all the way up to 8,700 RPM. A very distinctive highlight of the R8 V-10 are the all-LED headlights as standard equipment. Audi is the world's first automaker to use LEDs for the high beam, low beam, daytime running lights and turn signals. The 4,038 Ford GTs produced between 2005 and 2006 take inspiration from the legendary Ford GT40 that took first, second, and third at the 1966 24 Hours of Le Mans. With no carbon fiber or computerized driving aids, the Ford GT may feel a bit outdated compared to other modern supercars. But like the car it was based on, once you head out onto the track, the numbers do the talking. An all-aluminum 5.4-liter V8 is mid-mounted and sits low in the car's frame, supercharged to produce 550 bhp at 6,500 rpm. The car can accelerate to 60 miles per hour in 3.7 seconds. Capable of reaching speeds of over 200 miles per hour, the car remains responsive and will slide without ever feeling like it will bite. Although at first glance it may seem to be identical to the Ford GT40, the Ford GT is in fact longer, wider, taller and structurally very different. The 2006 model year saw two limited edition paint schemes added to the Ford GT's palette. Tungsten grey with silver stripes and the distinctive heritage blue and orange heritage livery option. The original Supersports was a limited-run 3-liter, created in the 1930s to break performance records. The Continental Supersports, armed with pure energy and adrenaline, is a continuation of Bentley's attitude towards performance and pursuit of new extremes. To create the fastest, most powerful Bentley ever would require a very special type of engine. The result is a 6-liter flex-fuel twin turbocharged W12, producing a staggering 800 newton meters of torque. Not only is this engine immensely powerful, it is also possible to run it on E85 biofuel. A smoked steel finish features prominently on the detailing of the Supersport's minimalist body. Its bonnet vents, matrix grill, and headlight surrounds all benefit from a technique called physical vapor deposition, which is usually associated with the high-quality finish found on luxury watches. Be assured it is a fighter. Successor to the famed Diablo, the Murcielago was first introduced in 2001. In a continuation of Lamborghini's tradition of giving its cars names from the world of bullfighting, the Murcielago was the name of a fighting bull that survived 28 sword strokes in 1879. The LP640 in its name refers to the position and power of its engine longitudinale posteriore, rear longitudinal, and 640 horsepower at 8,000 RPM, capable of a top speed of 211 miles per hour and a 0 to 60 time of 3.4 seconds, the car defies what is usually expected from cars of this size. The front and rear fascias were restyled along with the side vents, which opened to cool the V12 engine when required. A new exhaust system has been shaped into the rear diffuser, and the air intake on the left is enlarged to accommodate the oil cooler. A 2010 Dodge Viper SRT10 American Club Racer regained the street-legal production car lap record at Laguna Seca from a one-off exotic prototype with a time of 1 minute 33.915. A fitting finale for the current generation Dodge Viper, which entered production on July 1, 2010. Specifically modified and tuned for track performance, the road-legal Dodge Viper SRT10 ACR features racing dampers and shocks and many aerodynamic and lightweight components. The large rear wing is able to generate an amazing 1,000 pounds of downforce at 150 miles per hour. A fanged front splitter, rear wing sculpted by computational fluid dynamics, and painted sidewinder wheels add to the already bold looks of the Dodge Viper SRT10.
Codename Blue Devil, the ZR1 is the most powerful and most expensive Corvette model ever. The ZR1 is the first production Corvette to achieve a top speed of over 200 miles per hour, and one that can match the performance of other exotics costing at least twice as much. While the ZR1 shares the Z06's aluminum chassis, its suspension tuning has been optimized for the car's incredibly wide front and rear tires. To achieve its performance goals, a supercharger was added to the 6.2-liter V8 that pushes its peak power up to a jaw-dropping 628 bhp at 6,500 rpm. With a raised carbon fiber hood that incorporates a clear polycarbonate window showing the engine's intercooler, the Chevrolet Corvette ZR1 is instantly recognizable. <laughs> Originating from the pits of Le Mans after a 16th overall victory, the engineers went on to develop a concept to show what was technologically feasible. 1,270 handcrafted units were built because exclusivity occasionally needs a limit. Underpinning the Carrera GT is a self-supporting carbon fiber body which can handle 603 bhp and a speed of 201 miles per hour while remaining incredibly light. The Carrera GT is lighter than the current lightest Porsche available. The world's best-selling high-performance car of 2006 is instantly recognizable as a Porsche. The typical Porsche front includes three air intakes, which identify the commitment to managing airflow in the overall design. The engine cover is a beautifully crafted twin power dome of cross-drilled stainless steel. <laughs> F1-inspired design and performance. In 2004, Mercedes-Benz and McLaren set out to continue the story of the legendary SLR sports car from the 1950s. 722 is the starting number and start time of the Mercedes-Benz 300 SLR, driven by Sterling Moss when he recorded the fastest ever time for the Mille Miglia. The SLR was the world's first full ground effect front engine car and still is. With a completed flat underside leading into the diffuser, the only place for the exhaust to go were out the side. Featuring weight-optimized components, an uprated engine, and a specifically tuned chassis and air brake, the overall SLR dynamics have been improved. Painted carbon fiber blends seamlessly with the exclusive crystal antimony gray paint finish and the darkened design of the front and rear light clusters. The body has also been lowered by 10 millimeters and the light alloy wheels sport an all new design. Just 20 examples of the Reventon went on sale with the 21st being built for display at Lamborghini's museum. Costing $1,350,000 and looking more like a stealth fighter, this is the ultimate weapon in destroying motoring preconceptions. To ensure the Reventon was at least as fast as the LP640, its engine has been tuned to develop even more power. All-wheel drive and low-profile 245 front and 335 rear Pirellis help keep this wannabe aircraft agile on the ground. Looking at the car, you can still see traces of the Murcielago underneath all the aggressive, angular panels. The front is now dominated by two large air intakes that help cool the brakes. The angular nose is mimicked in the now obligatory transparent engine cover and the rear spoiler. The MP412C is the latest creation from a company with 20 years of car design experience and Formula One success. A bespoke V8 engine was designed from scratch to be more power efficient than any hybrid and able to produce 80% of its torque below 2000 RPM. Built from lightweight materials and positioned low for optimum handling dynamics, it complements the all-carbon monocell. The V8 is twin turbocharged and will redline at 8500 RPM. Forget what you think you know about sports cars. Relying on their top secret simulator to develop engine, aerodynamics, braking and steering, the engineers were fully able to concentrate on optimizing the 12C's driving experience. For a strictly limited number of discerning customers, 177 fuses advanced technology with stunning Aston Martin design to create what is possibly the world's most desirable automotive art form. Aston Martin's 177 exists at the intersection between a limited edition artwork and pure technological innovation. The 77 people who will become owners are making a major commitment. Their reward? A car that is the culmination of all the elements that define Aston Martin's modern era. V12 power, lightweight construction, 
modern material, craft skills, design excellence, and naturally, raw beauty. For Aston Martin, 177 is a unique opportunity to create a car as functional art, an object of beauty and contemplation that can also be interacted with, enjoyed by a select few on a strictly personal basis. The Pagani dealer for Hong Kong had a very unique proposal, to be able to sell road legal Zonda R's. At a cost nearing $2 million each, only five cars were built, which is why the car is named Cinque. With an obvious focus on performance, the ride of the Zonda Cinque is very low. It is only through the use of exotic materials such as titanium and an aluminum magnesium alloy that allows the chassis, suspension and wheels to perform like a race car on the uneven surfaces of everyday roads. The fastest Lamborghini ever. With the Super Veloce name and a price tag of $450,000, a lot is expected from the Murcielago LP670 4SV. Lamborghini don't disappoint. Everything about this car is pure perfection. Optimized valve timing and a reworked intake system has pushed the power output of the 6.5 liter V12 engine to 670 horsepower. Reworked aerodynamics all around mean the most extreme Murcielago is capable of hitting speeds of up to 212 miles per hour. From the monstrous rear wing that looks over the engine cover's transparent hexagonal polycarbonate plates to the enlarged front splitter and rear diffuser which guide the airflow around and under the car with purpose, there is an unmistakable purity of intent that the Super Veloce fulfills. The spirit of performance. The record-breaking CCX Competition Coupe 10th Anniversary Edition was developed to deliver superior performance both on the track and on the road. With no gadgets or unnecessary features, every aspect of this machine serves a fundamental purpose, to reach ultimate speeds and efficiencies. Re-engineered to comply with stringent new U.S. regulations, the CCX builds on the CC lineage of Koenigsegg cars. The supercharged 4.7-liter V8 built by Koenigsegg, combined with an ultra-lightweight chassis, gives you a very impressive 683 bhp per tonne. A scoop on the bonnet, redesigned front lamps and side skirts help to distinguish this Koenigsegg from the others and improve on what was already insane performance numbers. 0 to 60 miles per hour in 3.2 seconds and a top speed of over 240 miles per hour. Created to celebrate 15 years of outstanding performance, Ajira, the Swedish verb to act, is used to symbolize everything that Koenigsegg does best. With over 1,000 newton meters of torque available from 2,680 to 6,100 RPM, zero fade brakes regardless of track or road conditions, the latest hypercar from Koenigsegg continues the evolutionary approach and tradition to perfect the end result based on previous experience. Also short for the Greek word ageratos, which in ancient Greek means ageless, the original shape of the Koenigsegg CC created 15 years ago is still valid today. The Ajira stays true to the original philosophy, shape, and size of the original CC. At the same time, it looks, feels, and performs like something belonging to the future. Designed by Gordon Murray, the McLaren F1 held the record for the fastest production car in the world for seven years. There may be faster cars, but the McLaren F1 is still the fastest naturally aspirated production car, with a speed of 240 miles per hour set on March 31, 1998. Weighing only 1,140 kilograms and incorporating a specially built 6.1 liter V12 from BMW, the McLaren F1 is able to achieve speeds of 240 miles per hour due to its refined aerodynamics and incredible attention to detail. 
With no power steering or assisted braking, the car demands a lot from its driver, but will also reward them with a unique driving experience. There are a lot of unique features for the McLaren F1 that are added, purely for their focus on driver and performance, like the central seating position, gold leaf-lined engine bay, this was for heat dissipation. Only 64 of the standard road-going version were made, which has pushed the price of owning one upwards of twice the original asking price. The Bugatti Veyron 16.4 is one of the key milestones of 21st century automotive engineering. The technical requirements were challenging. Top speed above 400 kilometers per hour and in excess of 1,000 horsepower. Quad turbocharged 8.0 liter W16 powering all four wheels means one thing. Insane acceleration. In fact, the only thing more impressive than the 2.5 seconds it takes to get to 60 miles per hour is the stopping power of its huge ceramic brakes, which can bring it to a halt again in 2.3 seconds. Ingenious aerodynamics are the only thing keeping the Veyron on the ground at high speed, with the car literally changing shape as it accelerates to top speed. The Ultimate Edition only four of these cars will be built, each one representing the pinnacle of Koenigsegg's quest for ultimate performance. The twin-turbocharged 5.0-liter V8 can also be run on biofuel. When run on E85, 85% ethanol, the engine will generate an improved peak power of 1,018 bhp at 7,000 rpm. A rear wing has been added to push the 20-inch rear wheels into the tarmac and helps it achieve its 0-60 to 60 miles per hour time of 2.8 seconds. A clear lacquer finish reveals the beautiful carbon fiber construction, with each section painstakingly matched with its neighboring sections to create a stunning pinstripe effect. Contrasting colors adorn the external trim to create a frighteningly expensive look.